Welcome back everyone to the melee playthrough. So I built a bunch of houses. I have no idea what we're gonna do today actually. But I built houses, some up here just to get NPCs moving in, some down there to get NPCs moving in. So Whoa. So me as this man got a chef hat on him. What's that hat he's wearing? Oh, the chef is like on top of What the fuck? Let me talk to the chef! I want to talk to Chef. You guys, get in. Get on in. Oh, I forgot to update the juice mod again. Oh, my God. You guys. All right. Guy. You guys. <laughs> no. All right. Apple pie. Increase magic damage. Is there any that increase melee? There's none that increase melee, but there's one that increases magic. That's kind of odd. Let's buy, like, 161. It's perfect. Uh, and we need to put these somewhere up here, don't we? Yeah. But look at this. Fork. I'm buying all of these. Fork, spoon, kitchen knife. Hello, these are amazing. These are amazing. I need to store all this stuff. So we're going to reforge this. This is what I wanted. And also the knight, he sells some stuff. Hold up. Uh, let's pull this shit in here. No, I need the wood. I don't know what that noise I was making, by the way. <laughs> I don't know what it was. Uh, and then let's reforge everything. I want to use this shit. I want to just poke people with a fucking fork. So there's a knife. There's the fork. There's a spoon. Okay. I feel like the spoon is the best one. Shameful. Now nah, we can get something better. Mm. Nasty. There we go. It's perfect. A uh, fork. Can I get a size? A size thing? No. Man, get out of here. <laughs> I'll beat your ass with a spoon. Don't. Okay. Wait, I didn't see what it was. Forceful fork. 20%, 28% damage, but cursed. I'm good. I don't want that. I'll take a... Uh, Yes, fine. I'll take superior and then kitchen knife. Bulky. Minus 14% speed. That's actually not that bad. I don't know. I don't like it. Oh, I'm good though. The fuck infinite mana cost. I'm good. There we go. So there's our there's our set of fucking silverware that we're gonna use on something. I don't know what, but we're gonna use it on something. Let's figure out what that something is. Maybe an eye Cthulhu. Do I have anything to spawn one? Do I have any spawns in general? I don't think I do. No, I don't. Hmm. So in this episode, I think we might actually take on an attorney of crystal. If not that, uh, I think we might just go to the aquatic. Actually, no. You know what I want to do? I want to fight. I want to fight uh, Skeletron is what I want to do. How did he get down here? What the fuck? I don't... Right. <laughs> I guess he's staying down there. Zombie leg. Cursed. I don't want it. <laughs> if it's cursed, I don't want it. Alright, so... Let me move my chair. So we're going to fight Skeletron. Uh, we're going to attempt to fight Skeletron. Is it almost daytime though? I don't know how long it's been nighttime. Maybe we'll wait until the next the next night. So, in the meantime, I've been looking for armor and I can't really find any armor that I like. Like at all. Marnite spear. That looks pretty good. Uh so I guess this is what we'll do. Is it food? No. Mug. Wait, we haven't even fought the worms yet. Let's let's do that. We haven't fought wait no. We can't fight the worms. What am I talking about? We haven't fought the mother spitter. Who the fuck is hitting me? Spitter? Is it was spitter bait? Twelve rough, rough flesh. We got four right there. Here we go. Oh my god, there's a lot. Oops. Uh, there you go. That's twelve. I really need to make. Holy shit. What's a knockback? A very strong knockback. <laughs> I need to make a 
better potions soon. That needs to be a thing that happens because uh, I'm in dire need of some better potions. I think our accessories are pretty good where they're at. Probably should switch back to this. I think they're pretty good where they're at. Um, but my demon altar is down here, right? My armor needs to upgrade eventually, and I switched to this armor. I don't know why I switched to it. I'm gonna go switch back, actually. <laughs> I don't think it matters that much. Our damage taken is reduced by 10. Uh, I don't think it matters which one I wear, to be honest. My defense go Yeah, when my defense goes up. It's expected, this armor. It's uh, when... Dude, fuck me, dude. I don't, I don't even... I don't even want to hang up armors anymore. What's the point if they all do that? Like, 90% of them do that. Alright. Whatever bug that is, that needs to, like, change. It's so annoying. Alright, let's, uh... What the fuck do we... Let's just fight it right here, right? Might as well. I'm gonna use this book. I don't know what the fuck this book does. And I've had it for a while. Well, you can't use weapons. Can't use weapons while this is out. What? There we go. Holy shit. I was wondering what was going on there. I'm not using silverware to fight this. Oh my god, my health bar. I was at like full health a second ago. Now I'm almost dead. Jesus. I wish we were able to crowd control, but we kind of lost the ability to use weapons for a good while there. Oh my god, we might actually die to this bitch. I didn't expect to be fucking disabled when I entered this fight. Oh my god. There's a whole lot of spinning going on here. Let's get to use our ranged weapons. And we should be fine. I'll try my best to crowd control and use our ranged weapon, but it's not exactly an easy task. Why do I end up always fighting shit over here? I can make that underground arena. That's it. I, I plan for the underground arena to be a hard mode thing. Not really a pretty hard mode thing, anyways. Uh, because I still need to set up all the houses, which is a lot of work. But we'll see how it goes. Is this bitch still spawning spitters? Oh my god. If I get hit by that, like, wall of spit, that might be an insta kill. <laughs> Alright, hold up. I need to heal this. This is working out, though. Nice little just launching this purple shit at her. Where'd she go? There she is. I thought she was gonna despawn. Yeah. Uh um <laughs> I'm getting bounced around. Where is she? Don't go into that crowd of your minions. I can't kill you when you're in the crowd of your minions. Keep on hitting it. Oh she goes into like a defensive state. Oh she's like a mimic, that's her AI, okay. Wait, I want the I want the goods. Oh god. Don't make me Fight me assholes. This thing's useless. It's straight up hundred percent useless. Look. Cannot use a barrier. Unable to use weapons. What? Why is that a thing? Hold up. Okay. We gotta kill all these things. Oh my this is not happening! Ah, uh, wait, got it. No, you can't even read a fucking book. I thought that bitch. I don't want to be over there anymore. I gotta get ready though. They're gonna be coming over here. Let's go, assholes. Are they coming? Maybe they aren't coming. I'm gonna stand right here. Let's see. No, we good. We good. Okay, good. That was a lot, that was a lot of dudes to fight. So I didn't really get to use my silverware. I'll find something to use it on. Eventually. Let's see what we got. Spit of glands, rough flesh, mother's brain. I mean mother brain mother's brain is a good weapon. I don't even have any mana. Let me get some mana. I don't know if you guys have seen it before, but it's pretty cool. Summons in some things and then they shoot at stuff. So let's sell that. Do you sell melee stuff? Poison, potent extract. Cactus fruit's always pretty good. 
I'm about like 10 of them. Scorpion. Plague st uh, st staff. Spellbook Wing Gust. Hey, big time. Okay. So let's see what we can make with the Spitter Glands. Probably nothing. I feel like I didn't get a lot. No, we can make a ham axe or pickaxe. It's better than what I have, so might as well. So we just need iron. Where is our iron? There it is. Boom. There's this pickaxe. Murderous. Watch out. That bitch is murderous. I'm not going to make the super pickaxe from Thor, uh, Tremor. It's not even super, to be honest. But I'll just say super. <laughs> Uh, what is this? So, Rotten Brain. I I think I'll use this. Because it does have a little effect when you get hit. It rains down stuff. So, I think I'll, I'll keep that. Oh, shit. Alright, hold up. So, let's talk to my boy right here. My boy, Wheatley. See what melee weapons he's selling. Got the Toxic Razor Knife. Uh, I've used that in the past. I think I've used all of this in the past. Now that I think about it. Tomb Raider, Ripper Knife, which is a material. I'll buy that. Uh, I guess we can just buy everything to show it off. Might as well. And then, yeah, I guess I'll buy that too. Whatever. Is this the little baby sword? This is a little baby sword. The thing about like 90% of tremor weapons is you can't turn while using them. I don't know how they went wrong with that. <laughs> I'm not even trying to roast tremor. But there's no weapons in the mod, I'm pretty sure, where you can turn back and forth. Oh, maybe. No. <laughs> I mean, this is pretty fast. This is a good weapon. This is a good early game weapon. If I, had, if I had a Wheatley earlier, this would definitely be a good weapon to use. And then the Razor Knife is okay. Minus this. <laughs> uh, Actually, I've never seen this version of the Razor Knife. The Ripper Knife is actually pretty good. Let's uh, look at the recipes. It's a pretty good shit you can make with it later on. So we'll keep it. Uh, I guess the other ones I'm gonna sell. I don't care about the other ones. Well, let's use this right here. But yeah, good early game weapon. I had this, I think, during the Summoner playthrough. The, well, I guess, I don't know. I call it the Summoner playthrough even though we use a lot of weapons because it wasn't my first modded playthrough. And I wanted to actually use a good bit of stuff there. We got a razor knife though. So this could be a pretty good range melee weapon. So do we have a granite biome? We don't have much is what we have. Actually, no, there is a granite biome over there. We need to defeat Skeletron either way. Alright, let's look at the boss list. Oh, I know who we can fight. I know who we can fight. Where is it? We can fight this motherfucker. What are my potions? I swear I had a bunch of more potions. Or a bunch of more stuff for potions. Uh, so there's that. And then we need the ore. We'll get, we'll get it later. But hopefully we can take on Skeletron. Not the most hopeful when it comes to fighting Skele Skeletron right now. But I still got hope inside. Of me. Enough hope. That's all we need. Uh, we need to... We're going to the jungle. That's where we're going. Okay. So we need to go to the jungle. So many fucking presents. We need to go to the jungle. And we need to uh, set up an arena. Do I have an arena set up over there? I should have one set up. I don't know how this... Oh, yeah, look right here. I don't know how this boss works. Uh, I know the, the hell one. The hell one doesn't regen health if you do a lot of damage to it. But I don't know about the other two. The water one and this one. No clue what they do. How did I not pick that up? I was like right next to it. I don't know what they do. Hopefully they don't do anything crazy. Just fucking cut this down. I'm trying to get two different layers. So if I need to, I can run all the way to this direction. Which I don't think I'll need to. But we'll have it here anyways. And then let's go ahead craft campfire. There we go. So let's let's do this. I'm ready. Hopefully, oh my god, they don't have mini map icons. Hopefully, I'm pretty sure this one is actually one of the DPS ones, and I think about it. But we'll see. 
Maybe I should hit him a bunch of times. See what happens. That or they all have a rage mode now. Might be one of the things. Yeah, this one. Let's see how much health he gains. Who's at 8,400? Oh. Okay. So yeah, you do have to take your time with this guy. Sadly. This one still sucks ass. The fire one. The fire one. The hell one's okay. Hell one you can actually fight. This one on the other hand. Eh. I really don't like these guys because the ones that do do it still. Okay, let's see here. I'm trying to figure out what would be the best weapon to use on this guy. Probably the, legitimately the fucking toxic razor knife. Something from Tremor. Holy hell. Tremor before 1.3 update. I may talk shit about Tremor a lot. That's only because I don't I don't agree with their uh, the way they've gone through updating their mod. Now, I've talked about this in the past, but how do you go from, you know, when I first started playing Tremor, they went from like, ooh, nice big 1.2 update that came out. It's like big ass update, added in like two, three new bosses. I don't remember how many bosses. I think it was like three. Yeah, it was Rook, Pixie Queen, Coglord, wasn't it? And Mother, no, not uh, Pixie Queen, Motherboard is what I meant to say. But how do you go from that <clears throat> to... 1.3 coming summer and there's like 1.3 coming sometime this year and then 1.3 not coming out sometime last year but now coming out sometime this year but you know we don't know when i don't and then there's a lot of like small bugs i mean they fixed some of the small bugs but there's still a lot of small bugs that aren't fixed that can easily be fixed in like a little like hot patch hot patch hot fix little baby patch but uh, I'm just waiting for 1.3. For example, Coglord, he could be easily fixed to actually be balanced to the stage of the game he's supposed to be fought in. But instead, you gotta wait for 1.3. I don't, I don't, I don't agree with their methods. But 1.3 should be good. It looks good from all the spoilers they release. It looks good. Hopefully, we can fucking beat this guy before. Uh, Nighttime fully arrives because I'm trying to have a nice, nice good fight with the cog look. Skeleton. Let's uh, let's talk about more of my opinion on the birds that still have this health thing. This guy just regen back to 4k once I got him down to 3k. Oops, my fault. But uh, I feel like damage caps don't really fit Terraria unless they're done in the way Blue Magic has done his. Where you actually, there's something like more you gotta dodge and you know, you gotta actually play play a little bit to I wouldn't say I wouldn't say perfection but you actually got to play smart <laughs> torch go behind that tree these guys early game damage cap not much to dodge not much reward after you kill them either hopefully these guys get like really revamped especially when it comes to loot and how they're fought because I I really don't like did he regen again what the fuck I was barely touching the man all right it's all good I'll just, it's, dude, it's nighttime. Please let me fight, be able to fight Skeletron. Okay, he's been defeated. Now it's Skeletron time. Okay, so I have an arena set up already, so we should be, should be fine. Uh, let's do this. Hey man, I'm ready to fight ya. Hold up, I just, I needed to place a torch. Sorry. So what, what's gonna be the best way to go about doing this? I don't have my alpha blade anymore. Since curse would do zero damage. We really do have to hit his hands first all the time. Which I don't enjoy doing. Come on man, I'll throw hands with you. I just I just need his hands to just line up with me. Just need them to line up with me. It's kinda dark. Kinda dark and I can't really Wait, dude, does this go through him? It does go through. So if we can hit him, hit his hands too at the same time, that'd be good. Kind of dark. So let me like place some torches. Place some torches here and there. All right, we're like halfway through the night. I think we have more than enough time. <clears throat> we should have more than enough time. I hope. Uh, not if I run into him like that. If you ever dash into Skeletron? This is why the shield dash is good and also terrible at the same time. Some bosses you should get stuck inside of them. If that's like a part of their move set, like just spinning on you. Okay, hold up. That's why I prefer getting the ninja one later on. Even though I like just recently started doing that. I didn't even touch you. 
Okay, hold up. Let's uh, keep our distance. I'm not trying to use a uh, health pot. Not yet, at least. I'm trying to save it for a second form. Like, directly into the second form, but... It's very tempting to use him because he's beating my ass. We almost got his hands down there. I'm going to do this and just hope that I can hit his hands or something with an AoE. Now that and he'll run into them. There we go. Yeah, he's kind of running into them. Okay, that's one hand. All right, we got both hands down at the same time. I think, I think we did pretty good there. I think we did pretty good. So while he does his spinning stuff, I'm pretty sure he doesn't shoot the skulls. Oh, shit. Straight out of it, he shot me with the skull. I'm trying to think here. Back to the razor knife, I guess. This is our best range weapon. We just gotta DPS him though once he goes into spinning mode. This is a good DPS, but I feel like I gotta get a little close. A little close for comfort. Oh my god, did you see that fucking 200 crit? That's pretty good. 200, 100 crit. But when he goes into skull mode, we'll keep our distance. Just fire these off. Ooh. Alright, you know, this time I'm keeping my distance. <laughs> I'm just gonna shoot you with all these, sir, if you don't mind. And then I'm gonna continue shooting you with them. I'm just trying to heal using only the uh, pies right now. I don't know why I went into my inventory to heal up like that. Here, let's try this out. Okay. Took a lot of damage that time. Fuck, dude. My timing is bad once he gets out of his second form. Like, luckily for us, we have a lot of air time. Ow. We can easily lose this fight. And I have high, high hopes that we will lose this fight if I keep on playing like this. Come on, Skeletron. Skeletron low-key my worst enemy. Like, pre-hard mode. I mean, hard mode is dog. Or, I guess it's post, post moon lord is dog. Devour guys. That's my, that's my enemy. Pre-hard mode, it might be Skeletron. Because I've had some fights with this guy. Especially the throwing playthrough. Me and this guy have a history. I think I fought him like 20 times in the throwing. Oh, maybe not 20. But a lot of times. And fighting Skeletron multiple times is not... Why do I keep going into my inventory to do that? Fighting Skeletron multiple times in any playthrough is annoying. Because you have to wait until daytime. And then you gotta wait until nighttime. That's You gotta wait like a whole... However many it's full terraria day or, or like 24 hours 24 hours yeah 24 hours you gotta go through one day time cycle and then you gotta go into the other one and then it's, it's pretty annoying especially if you die multiple times but we almost got him i think we we're gonna win yes the yes the yes to kill me daytime style like my hardcore character died that's the only way he can kill me at this point i mean it's more than possible i don't know what time of day it is right now time of night it is but if i just like do this we win boom bada bing it has been done it has been done now we can quickly run down here just quickly though i don't want to do too much down here i'll save that for another episode but we're gonna run down here and we're gonna actually gonna actually maybe we could spend time down here i want to go to the aquatic depth soon before like those weapons are gonna be useless to me but uh we'll see for now i want to run down here look for water bolts because those are always good to sell and they're also a cool decoration if you have the clay thing yeah i'll take these I'm trying to think there's the dark what's it dark steel i don't remember the name of the armor set but there's that armor set down here so we can attempt to get that if we want that's a really good armor set. Let me just uh, get all the water candles. Never know when I can use them. But that's a good armor set. Gives you a dash, so maybe I can even take out the uh, I Cthulhu dash for now. But I really need to look into accessories. I think our weapons are fine. It's our accessories that I need to upgrade a little bit. I guess I need to upgrade our weapons at the same time, too. Some of them are getting kind of out tier. Hold up. Let's use our spoon and shit now. This is a good time to use it. So I, I, pretty much what I want to be down here for is the, uh, to have the, oh, I thought the slime opened the door. Have the possibility to craft the, uh, Evan cart. I need to stop knocking this dude away. 
Or is it the Ebon Cart? Which one am I making? Whatever one is for the corruption. So I just need a couple of bones and then we can leave. And then we'll, I'll come back here. Uh, off camera, I guess. And try and get all the stuff I need for the armor set. Boy, I'm about to... Boy, I'm about to spoon you. Speak about not being able to turn around. I don't know if that's a thing for some weapons or what. But it's pretty bad. <laughs> I don't like that. The thorium doesn't get off easy here either because you can't turn around with these. Maybe it's a feature in Tremor. Maybe everything's supposed to be like that and I'm bashing Tremor for no reason. Either way. Stay woke. Spirit mod coming out soon. Find a weird enemy here. Granite Wanderer. He doesn't look too granite-like. Looks like a little darker than granite is. But that's really cool looking. Granite Rod. It's a magic weapon. Um, Jesus Content Pack. Okay. Is there granite nearby? Or does he just like naturally spawn in here? There has to be granite nearby. There's a lot of fucking Metroid dudes in here. There has to be granite nearby. There's one down there that just shot at me. Alright, you guys need to go. Let's get our old wide ass swing weapon. Shambler! Shambler! So it sucks that a lot of the armor sets disappear. Boy, you don't know what's up right now. Because I wanted to make like an armory room where it'd be like the armor set and then it's like uh, tools and stuff around it. It's not tools, it's weaponry around it. I don't know, if you guys tell, have, have a fix for that or something, that would be nice. If you can tell me or anything that can fix it. Uh, shout out. Fuck, I don't remember his name. But shout out to a person who helped me fix that memory error thing. Even though I think it was personally my fault. Because I straight up fucked the game over. I don't remember what I did, but I was messing with the game. And I had an out of memory crash. <laughs> Oops. Uh, I think it was some of the multiplayer I was doing and it fucked it up. Even though I had one. I haven't had them too too often, as I usually have them. So next, next what I'm hoping we can all figure out together is how to make Ferrari get load faster. Team mod loader load faster. Because it gets pretty annoying, the load times. Even though, like, I haven't been, actually been bothered too much by the load times. I still like having short load times. Because, uh, I guess it doesn't crash that much, so... Loading is not really a thing I need all the time. I don't know. I'm hoping that I can figure a way. I want to eventually move my game to my SSD, but don't know if that'll fuck up paths and everything. I gotta move a lot of stuff. I don't know. Maybe when we're halfway through the playthrough. Hey, look, it's you. Just, uh, just stay alive, alright? Stay alive, because I want to sell some stuff to you, alright? Hope you don't mind. Bag of life. Bone glove. Bone hand. Guys, that look like a bone hand. Look at this. Four chest all like side by side by side. Nice. I don't know if I have enough inventory to pick all of it up. I'll try my best though. I'll try my best. Let's see here. We don't need that. We don't need thick gel. We we'll put the angry shackle over there. Uh, that's decent enough. Ow. That's decent an amount of space. That's a decent amount of space. I do want to kill this guy real quick. Dark steel is what we need. You know, I said I'd get it off camera. You know, might as well, if I have the chance to get it, might as well get it. All right, let's open up three chests here. That's one. Fuck out of here. Oh shit! We got a Grady painting. Who's that? Who the fuck is Gray, Gray, Grady? I know who Grady is. Alright, so what else do we need? Gold bars. And this is the last one. We get a fucking godly blue moon. Awesome. Exactly what I wanted. How did you know? It's like on Christmas Day, you open up presents. Like, How did you know I wanted a godly blue moon? Wow. Alright, so before we end off the episode... Let's check out what this guardian essence does. Guardian necklace. Ooh. Melee crit. Oh, we need five of them. What the fuck? Mental necklace. Okay, that's the mana one. It's the ranged one. Of course, no love for the other classes. Uh, guardian knuckle. 
It gives dodge frames upon hitting an enemy. Guardian stick. Watch out now. I'm gonna hit you with my stick. Guardian yo-yo. Okay. We got a guardian pickaxe. From that fight. Pickaxe used by guardians of magical. These are cool weapons. But we the thing is, we kind of need the... The... Uh, what is it? More guardian essences. SI. So maybe... Uh, we need to fight him again? I don't know. But first, let's get to crafting this right here. Crim cart. Crim cart. So we need 20 crimstone, 5 elastic fibers. 20 crimstone, 5 elastic fibers. You tell me I don't have any fucking crimstone, dude? Wait, do I actually not have crimstone? No, I do. Wait, what do I, what do I keep on thinking is crimson? This one is corruption. Duh. What? I, I don't know. This is the first time I... Well, not the first time, but... I think it's because me and Ryan, we always get crimson when I play with him. So I was just thinking about it. Okay. Where is it? Ebon Cart. A long time in the making for this one. Oh, man. 